We've been building our own superchargers for 30 years. We design all of our superchargers from the point where it's just a concept, all the CAD design, all the way to manufacturing. You know, we manufacture our own rotors in-house. What Whipple wants out of a supercharger is efficiency, whether it's a new port job to get more horsepower, whether it is a new kit, or it could be a race kit for an existing application, we are always working on something new. The Whipple advantage is that we design and build our own superchargers. We want to put out the best product that we can. We want to put out the product that makes the most power. We want to beat everybody else. That's just who we are. It's in our DNA. The first stage in the process of building a supercharger is to identify the application that it's going to be in. From there, we're going to start to identify all of the interfaces associated with that particular vehicle. And we're going to start to bring that together into what do we need to go out and design new and what do we use that we currently have. We try to make sure that everything that we're doing is heading us down a path of success for that particular part. We're not rolling the dice, guessing, and then hoping it fits. When we work with outside companies, we hold them to the same standards we hold ourselves to. I would say the manufacturing process starts right here in my machine shop. We make parts that go into the supercharger itself. We make the supercharger through shafts. We machine them here, then they go out for heat treat and grind, come back, and then we press them into the rotor blank. We throw it in the machine, and then we cut the rotor profile. We make supercharger parts, we cut the supercharger rotors, we get castings in for the parts that we don't make. Once we receive the parts, they get coated, cleaned, and then moved on over to assembly. What leaves assembly is a completed supercharger compressor. And from there, it goes to kit assembly. And kit assembly is where they mate the compressor to the rest of the supercharger kit, which includes intake manifold, intercooler cores, belts, pulleys, everything else that makes up the kit. Once done with kit assembly, it's rolled on over to shipping where it's packed up and shipped out. Whipple Superchargers is always expanding our capability. We're always adding new machines, we're always adding new software, we're always adding new measurement capacity to be able to provide the best product we can. Each new capability that we add is a huge investment, but we found it's the only way for us to be able to make the product that we want to give the customer. As a gearhead myself, I obsess over this. What I like about Whipple's approach is we're always trying to go faster. I love drag racing. I obsess about horsepower and we live it every day here.